Hello, hello everyone, my name is Laura and this is my channel Laura's Little Library and welcome to today's video which is my August TBR. So this video is going to be pretty short, pretty simple, very casual as you can tell by the fact that I'm sitting in front of my dresser with crappy lighting. I've been reading a lot, but I've been terrible at sticking to my TBRs, and I don't want to get too repetitive on here, so like, some of the books that I want to read, I've had on my past like two or three TBRs on my summer TBR, I still haven't read them, People We Meet on Vacation, Book Lovers by Emily Henry, Sway With Me, those are kind of the main three that I've had on my TBR for quite a while, I'm still hoping to get to them in August, like I will get to them in summer. Five of those that I'm still wanting to get to, I have Last Chance Books, and this is a book that I actually picked up from the library, and I hope to read that soon. I do have the audiobook version for it, which is why I think I'm actually going to read it. Uh, I still need to read For the Throne. Again, I, I have the audiobook for that. I've just been putting it lower on the prioritizing when, uh, <laughs> when I look for a new book to read. Um, so those are kind of all the repetitive ones plus my library book. The thing is is that I had gotten other books that I was going to put on the August TBR that I wanted to read that were more summery um, and then I just got so excited and I started reading them. Anyway, so I read, I've been averaging about a book a day somehow. Um, these are like some shorter kind of just summer fantasy books and I've been very much enjoying them so that's kind of what I've been filling my time with for now but I'm almost done with those on my, my last one of those and then then I can go back to actually following my TBR for once. <laughs> so then some of the other books that I want to read in August is uh, Lily Quinn. It's part of the uh, Grimalkin series that I picked up from an author in Minnesota. I want to finish that series and the companion standalone book that I have. Those are pretty short. They should be pretty quick for me to get through. The problem is I just haven't been physically reading and a lot of my summer books I only have physically and I just haven't sat down to read them. But I am quitting one of my jobs a little early for the summer so that'll give me a little more time. Then I also really want to read Six of Crows by Leigh Bardugo before uh, more of the show Shadow and Bone comes out. I want to get caught up on those. I want to read The Last Legacy by Adrian Young, which is like book 2.5 from a duology of fable. I read the first two books of the duology fable and namesake, um, and I want to read Saint when it comes out. I've been loving those. You can hear more about it in the wrap up at the end of the month. Uh, honestly, I just don't want to put too many new things on my TBR because I just want to make sure I get to the old things. I do plan on doing like a hot girl summer vlog, just kind of reading the books that I've been wanting to read that will give me summery vibes and vlogging it. So that will be happening very soon. And yeah, that's really all I say. have to say. Like I said, short, sweet, casual books I'm going to read in August. Anyway, but also it's already almost August and August is like the last month of summer. We leave back to Minnesota at the end of August. So we've got like a month left and there were so many other books that I brought with me from Minnesota that was like they're bigger, I want to read them over the summer because theoretically I would have more time and energy. Nope. I brought Wildcat and The Toll and The Help and What Once Was Mine, like those were all books that I was gonna read at some point this summer and then just didn't so I just, I, hmm, got a lot that I want to read but yeah so that's everything. Thank you all so much for watching this like I said, very casual, just short little, all the books that I still have yet to read before the weather gets a little colder. I mean, not that it's going to get cold, but like before fall. I'm so excited for fall. But anyway, like I said, thank you for watching. I post videos normally on Sundays and Wednesdays, but in the summer it's been a little up in the air. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what books you want to read in August or some books you still want to get to this summer in the last month of summer um otherwise feel free to subscribe and i will see you all in the next video but until then happy reading mm -hmm.